Hello, today in this video we are going to show you how to create a module in Odoo 12 using the scaffold. Right now I have logged in the database and here I am in the apps menu. I will make a search of a module with name my Odoo module. Okay, I am typing it. Okay, right now you can see there is no module name my Odoo module with the technical name. So we will go to the PyCharm and we will create a new module with the name my Odoo module. So here I am using Odoo 12 as I told you before. You can see in this here Odoo bin is here in this current path that is inside Odoo bar Odoo 12. You can see the Odoo bin. Using this Odoo bin, we can create the scaffold. Using the scaffold, we can create the module. For that, type slash Odoo bin scaffold. Give your module name. That is, I'm going to create a module with name my Odoo module. So I'm typing that is first slash Odoo bin space scaffold space module name. Also, we have to specify in which location the module has to be created. Right now, I am going to create the module inside the Odoo apps menu. That is my custom add-ons. So, I specify my Odoo apps. Then click the enter button. Right now, you will get a module inside that specified path. If you look at the inside Odoo apps, you can see a new module with the given name is created. That is my Odoo module. So, the system structure, module structure is automatically generated. This is the manifest file of the module. The basic syntax you need for a module. So I restarted the service. Uh, I restart the service and we'll go to the front end uh, for the newly for the new module to get listed here. I have to activate the developer mode first. So I will activate the developer mode. For that, I will go to the settings. You can see the option of activating the developer mode here. I will activate the developer mode. So I restarted the service. Activated the developer mode. Click on update app list, click on update button. So right now the uh, app list is updated. Now I will make search again my Odoo module. This is my Odoo module. So right now I can see the module or right with uh, which I have created using the scaffold. So this is the module we have right now we have created using the scaffold. So I will open the module. If you check the module info, you can see the details we have, the details that is specified in the manifest file. These are all the default information which will come. The license will be LGPL version, uh, website is there, category is there, summary is there. All these are the default things that is coming from the scaffold. So if we go to the manifest file, you can see this information here. So this information here is shown in the apps page. So this is all about how to create a module easily using the scaffold. If you have any queries, you can 